Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do another upper body that is quick and effective and is going to leave the upper body burning. You are going to need two sets of dumbbells. I'm using fives and tens, but as always, please pick weights that feel good for you. And you're also going to need a yoga mat or some sort of cushioning beneath your feet. We are going to do six exercises for two rounds and the timing will be 40 seconds of work with 20 seconds of rest. And as always, you already know, please make sure that you warm up and activate before this workout. And if you're ready, let's get to it. Our first exercise is going to be around the world. I'm using my fives. We're going to take the arms up. We're going to draw a big O or a big um, circle. Are you ready? Palms are out, shoulders are down. Let's go. All the way up, all the way down. Drawing this big circle, taking the arms up and taking the arms down. So we're not letting the arms swing or just drop, we're lowering them, okay? Let's go. 20 seconds left, all the way up, all the way down, all the way up all the way down amazing let's go 10 seconds left Ooh. so because you've activated those arms should be feeling this and done okay second exercise is going to be a combo we're going to forward press overhead press with both of the fives alternatively you can do forward overhead with just one okay Pick what feels good for you. Feet are shoulder width apart, shoulders down, forward, overhead. Forward, overhead. So today is upper body burn. Woo! <laughs> and this exercise reminds us why. Press, overhead. Forward, overhead. Tailbone is tucked, core is engaged. 15 seconds left, let's go, press, press, triceps, biceps, four, three, two, and one, okay, amazing, from here we're going to go into bent over rows, we're going to complement that push movement with a pull movement, hitting that back, I'm using tens, row, and slow for 40 seconds, okay? Find that hinge, shoulders rolled, away from those ears, row, slow. Amazing, let's go. Good. So we're keeping our knees slightly bent, back straight, pull, slow, pull, slow. Let's go. Amazing work, use that breath. The backs of your arms are feeling this. Ooh, they're gonna feel it even more. We're gonna go into our second circuit after this. In three, two, and one. Okay, drop one of those tens. I'm gonna use a 10, do what feels what good, what's good for you. We're going to do a face forward, tricep, overhead extensions, working the backs of those arms. Are you ready? Three, two, and one, let's go. So the arms, the elbows are close to the head. We're not doing this, we're keeping the elbows close in, really getting into extension, flexion. Ooh, pressing, lowering, pressing, lowering. 20 seconds left, down. Down, again, feet are hip to shoulder width apart. Strong base, triceps should be feeling this. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, next exercise I call a kayak. And essentially all we're gonna do is pretending like we're kayaking. We're going to twist. So we're working shoulders, arms, back and core. Are you ready? Let's do this. So think about drawing 
an eight or think about kayaking or canoeing you're twisting 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 again using that weight good feeling this through the ribs let's go 20 seconds upper body burn only two rounds today let's go 12 seconds arms on fire five Woo. three two and one okay last one we're gonna go into a side plank with rotation so you're either on your hand or on your forearm we're on the ground we are rotating and reaching for 40 seconds okay one let's go i'll show you modification on the other side so you're thinking about keeping your hips square reach rotate reach up scoop so you want that scoop to be like you really want to reach you don't want to make it small you want to feel this through that rib almost there 14 seconds good 10 amazing work five four three two one okay so drop 20 seconds of rest we're gonna switch it to the other side so like i was saying to you modification here you can be on your forearm okay so drop to the forearm lift through the hips we're going to scoop the same way and reach i'll do this for the first half let's go so scoop and reach so if your wrists are bothering you you're welcome to take this from the forearm and modify good that bottom leg is supporting us good we have 20 seconds left again if you're on that hand shoulder stays over that wrist scoop and reach upper body burn let's go 10 seconds left almost there five Ooh. three two and one good job okay we're gonna come back up onto our feet round two around the world grab those fives you already know if you've done my workouts round two round three always feels better the energy systems have caught up with the demand are you ready let's go 40 seconds all the way up all the way down good and use that breath inhale down exhale to help move that weight let's go round two you already know how this goes quick and effective strength training is so important if i can recommend two days of strength training if you can depending on where you are you know your journey four seconds Ooh, two and one okay now this is gonna burn forward press to overhead press I'm gonna turn sideways for this round so that you see a different viewpoint. Shoulders are down and back. We're gonna punch forward and then punch overhead. In three, two, tailbone tucked, core engaged. Let's go. Punch, punch, press, press. Let's go. And really take it to the full range of motion. So don't just go like halfway. I really want it to be all the way up, all the way down, all the way forward, all the way in, all the way up, all the way down. Full range. Let's go. Almost there. Less than 10. Woo. Oh my God. Three, two, one. Always finish the rep as well, okay? Drop those weights. I'm gonna grab my tens for those bent over rows. We have 20 seconds of rest. Are you ready? Second time you're doing this, last time you're doing this. In three, two, one, let's go. Good, 
so row, slow, row, slow. So we're not just letting the arms drop, right? We're taking them down, pulling, releasing, pulling, releasing. That neck, if you find it jumping in, shake it out very gently, and then come right back to me. Let's go. 12 seconds left. Woo! Yes. Four, three, two, and one. Amazing. Okay, drop that one weight. If you're using the weights that you just used, we're gonna go into tricep overhead extension, continuing to hit the backs of those arms. Are you ready? Cupping the weights in between your index and your thumb. Elbows in, tailbone tucked, 90 degrees. Let's go. So here, and then remembering that tension always. Good. Let's go. Let's go. Upper body burn. Woo. Let's get it. We have less than 20. Feeling in those triceps again. Triceps stay close to your body, close to your head. You're not flared. We're keeping that tucked. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, that kayak. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna call this. So we're just going to imagine we're kayaking, we're canoeing, we're really thinking about strength through that torso. Ready? Let's go. So 40 seconds. Yes, let's go. Twist, 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 twist. Yes. Last time you were doing these, let's go. Good. Twist, twist. Woo! 15. Let's go, core is on fire. Brace that core, twist. Imagine yourself drawing a figure eight. Woo! Yes. Three, two, one. Okay, on the ground, side plank with rotation to finish this. Are you ready? 20 seconds of rest. I'm gonna take this from my wrist. Again, take it from your forearm if that's what feels best for you. Knee at the bottom, hips are stacked over top, 40 seconds, let's go. Scoop and reach, scoop, reach, scoop, amazing. Let's go, 20 seconds left on this side. Let's finish this, today's only two rounds. 15 seconds, Woo. 10, and then the other side to finish, 5, 3, 2, and 1, amazing, slowly drop and turn on to our other side to finish this upper body burn, let's do this, 10 seconds of rest, remember recoup that breath in through your nose, out your mouth. One, 40 seconds, let's go. Scoop and reach. And the goal here is to keep those hips up, okay? So we're not here and twisting, the hips are not dropped. Remember that imaginary puppet master is lifting those hips as we rotate, feeling this through the underside of our side body. 15 seconds left. Woo. Up. Up. Good. Five, four, three, two, one, and done. Slowly drop, and we are done. Okay, another quick and effective upper body workout. This is again to continue showing you that you don't need to do hour-long workouts 
for you to get results. All it takes sometimes is 15 minutes and maybe that's all you have. I hope that you enjoyed today's quick and effective upper body burn. If you did, please go ahead, like, subscribe, follow, share this with a friend, leave me a comment, let me know what the hardest exercise today was, and I will see you soon. Bye.